How many times have we done stories oh, on yeah. just the unbearable conditions? Mm -hmm. It is going to be so that's nice for tomorrow. Them. They yeah, deserve exactly. it too, you know. <laughs> uh, weather's perfect. Any way you slice it, we are definitely reaping the rewards of that front that moved through early this morning, brought the thunderstorms last night. And here's what we have downtown right now. Yeah, we're going to turn the lights on there for you. Uh, in the city, we're at 60 degrees. That's as cool as we've been all day. We made it up to 74 for a high, average 84. But we spent the better part of the afternoon in the mid-60s. That's where our lows should be. And by the time you wake up tomorrow morning, these temperatures are going to be falling down into the low 50s. And I do believe uh, we'll probably have some upper 40s on the map here when Kelly joins us starting at 6 a.m. on sunrise. Mentioned band day. Here's the breakdown. At, at 8 in the morning, still going to be in the 50s. There will be some sunshine, quite a bit of it early in the day. Some clouds flaring up. They'll be harmless. And temperatures topping out anywhere from about 75 to 78. Comfortable humidity. ND11 have a match at the mic. Uh, Saturday evening weather is perfect for that against FC Edmonton. And then if you're heading to the Grant, uh, Brantley uh, Gilbert concert at Clips, again, weather is going to be ideal. We've been saying all along, Saturday, hands down, the better of the two days this weekend. So let's show you the latest with Future Track 13. Tomorrow night, by the time you wake up Sunday morning, it's going to be overcast here. We'll start to see some rain getting close. I think we'll have some dry hours in the morning. All bets off for dry weather by the time we head forward about noon. And then there will be some showers, some rumbles of thunder. Not expecting a whole lot of storm action here, but what will happen because of the clouds and the rain, probably going to keep our temperatures in check on Sunday. I think we may struggle to hit 70 in some locations. may get there, and then once the rain starts, uh, we'll see the showers moving in. Not going to be a washout, okay, but there will definitely be more rain around on Sunday, and, and that's going to make it, again, the wetter of the two days this weekend. Scattered storms as we get you, uh, get you going here on Monday, and then after that, we are back to a very quiet pattern. An average high of 84 degrees. Uh, we're going to see temperatures staying below normal. In fact, even next week, several mornings, where we're going to be in the 50s. So we're going to probably save some money on the energy bill here over the next 7 to perhaps 10 days, the way it's looking right now.